Kevin, a 3-2 defeat in the end for Southend. What was your overall assessment of that uh, performance? Yeah, bitterly disappointed um, because you can play ever so well like we did and create chances and get ourselves in front of the game twice, which you should go out and win the game. But, you know, for us, the goals are all soft. You know, making our own undoing, if you want, um, turn the ball over cheaply, which we want to play. But, you know, we've got to play the right pass at the right time. It's just a little bit of sloppiness and maybe mental fatigue that's, that's cost us. Is that what's killing you? The players are knackered, aren't they? Yeah, you can see that. You can almost feel it, can't you, at times? And sometimes our decision making then has got to be better. Um, and we want to play, but it's got to be the right, the right time and the right, the right balls. Saying that, we think we've had enough chances than. You know, the, the disappointing thing is probably that they've gone through us too easily at times, um, which, you know, there's no excuses for. It must be doubly disappointing because you got yourself into the lead twice in this fixture. Yeah, no, exactly. And at home as well, you want to go on and, you know, and, and take the game forward. But, you know, it looked like that half step too many at times and half a step couldn't get quite close enough and didn't win a tackle because we're half a step off. And that's what, you know, if you cut corners, that's what happens. The winning goal ultimately came from a free kick. A dodgy free kick, in your opinion? Yeah, listen, I know I'm not. it's not the referee's fault we've lost the game first and foremost, but there's fouls that I think the, the crowd reacts and you can tell it's not a foul and we can't get one fouls on power leaders, fouls there we can't get and all of a sudden he starts giving them second half and then it just lets them build up momentum. And listen, it's no, it weren't a free kick, but there's no excuse for us not defending it better. What do you take from this particular fixture? I suppose uh, goals from uh, Bridge and Gus Scott Morris get their seasons up and running. Yeah, which is pleasing. Um, Listen, it's hard to take anything at the minute because you lost the game and we hate losing games. But listen, you can, they're giving everything. They're giving absolutely everything again, but we need help. And that goes without saying. You can't um, cut corners on pre-season. You can't cut corners every which way we we have done as a club. And that's what you get. You cut corners and you'll get found out. And that's what's happening at the minute. It just underscores, isn't it? Yes, Blues have got another football match next Friday, but next week, midweek, is a big game for Southend. Yeah, and, you know, let's see what happens. You know, I, I'm not sure what's going to happen, um, but we need players. That, that goes without saying. We need to bring players in. Um, you know, we haven't done it for over a year, for almost a year now, and it's pretty obvious to anyone watching it what, what's needed. Um, the players have been incredible. The staff are incredible. Um, we need help, and that's you know, that's, that's you know, it not doesn't need me to say that, but that's where we're at. If you do come into that position where you can buy players, are you are you all set to go have you got things in the fire but it's, it's hard yeah. because you know we can talk to whoever we want people players are going all the time you know clubs are signing players all the time um, are people going to commit to South End when we're in the situation we're in um, I think there's plenty that will come want to come here because um, you see the crowd you see the fan base you see what the football we want to play um, but you know that pot gets smaller every day every, every week that goes by and we, you know we we know what we wanted six months ago. Yeah. That hasn't changed, you know, and what the players need is help and what we need is a little bit of help as well.